welcome to the first official vlog of summer. So obviously I had to sleep in, but when I woke up I got changed to go on a quick morning run because now we're in California and the weather is perfect for doing anything outside. But first I made my bed, which is a habit I've really been trying to be on top of every day because it makes me feel so much more productive. And then I put on the daily for my run and listened to the new podcast. When I got back, I had some almond milk peach flavored yogurt with some granola in it for breakfast and got my beach outfit picked out because we are heading to the beach. I try to do this little cute like video of my outfit, but they always work so much better on TikTok if you've seen people put together their little outfits. They're so cute. I'm obsessed with those videos. And then I just put on some moisturizer, sunscreen, and a little bit of makeup. Barely any though, just kind of fixing up my eyebrows and listening to the strokes. But this was honestly like such a good beach fit. This was a lot of my new birthday clothes. I have the new Brandy Melville tank top and shorts and then the bathing suit I was wearing underneath my mom got from an outlet for billabong so honestly slay new bathing suit but then I went downstairs and made this salad avocado prosciutto I don't know like burrito for lunch to take with me to the beach but before we head out I think we need a little like ketchup it's 11:40, different state back on the floor my skin right here has been getting so red because it's so dry and i am not gonna put on makeup right here because i'm about to go to the beach ignore that as it starts getting red this is like a weird setup anyways today is saturday may 14th happy like first official day of summer i'm back home in california and today is gonna be like pretty hot it's 80 degrees right now i live in socal so it doesn't get as hot as like la does so it's just like really comfortable weather and the breeze is kind of chilly sometimes i don't know but it's 80 degrees today so we are going to the beach and i thought this was like the perfect day to do first day of summer vlog i'm gonna bring my book and I just made that little burrito thing for lunch later. We're just gonna lay on the beach and read. And then tonight, I'm doing like a movie night with Porter, which is my youngest brother. I also have to take him to buy a comic because he helped me with something for like a film project. I'm gonna buy Porter a comic tonight and then we're gonna go get In-N-Out. I haven't had In-N-Out in so long. I'm trying to get rid of so many clothes. I have three bags of clothes right here in front of me. So I'm gonna take them to Buffalo Exchange tonight and try and like sell them. And then whatever it doesn't sell, I'm just gonna take to the military thrift store because I wanna get rid of them and I don't need them. And I feel like I have so many clothes and it kind of grosses me out how many clothes I have sometimes. So I'm just like, I just need to get rid of as much as I can. I submitted my last final for NYU like a couple days ago. So that's good. Freshman year, done. Also, I'm about to drive to the beach alone and I literally haven't driven a car since January because I go to school in New York City, so I don't have a car. We're gonna go to the beach, it's a little beach day. Let's go. These are all the clothes <laughs> that we need to take later. First beach day of the summer. Guys, it's summer. It's literally summer. Like, what do they say in High School Musical? Because that's us. These are my favorite sunglasses ever because they're so huge. They're kind of giving celebrity glasses. Like, when I used to walk around New York wearing these, it's a little obnoxious, like, not gonna lie, but they're so fun. I love them. I got them off Depop, but any giant sunglasses will do it. Like, the bigger the sunglasses, the better. I just pulled up, and it's so busy. Like, everyone decided to start Hot Girl Summer today. This is Hot Girl Summer. Well, it's always like Hot Girl. It should be Hot Girl Life, like Hot Girl Life for everyone, but tis the season, so Hot Girl Summer commencing. I thrive in warm weather, like I live in warmth. Okay, we're gonna eat this burrito. Not gonna lie, the burrito was not giving. It wasn't aesthetic, but it was so, so tasty. I ended up just staying at the beach for like two hours reading and listening to music. So much fun, so needed, and I ended up running some errands for my parents before I came home. And then once I got home, I lit some incense and then I had some work to do, some productive stuff. I actually got this quick like assistant editing gig for this feature film, which is like my first paid film job, so I was so excited. So doing some of that and then I had a little watermelon snack and filmed something for YouTube. Okay, I just found out this is such a cute filming spot instead of the floor. So we have a new cuter filming spot. I just filmed the haul for my 20th birthday vlog to end it off because I wanted to show what I got. But that went up the week before this video, which also I have to do tonight. I have to edit that whole video tonight because I haven't started. I've been so busy, but I always upload on Sundays and 
tomorrow's Sunday, so we should do that tonight. Anyways, did a little birthday haul, and Porter and I are about to go to Buffalo Exchange. I am dragging him along with me because it'll just be easier if we're already out. So we're gonna go to Buffalo Exchange. I'm gonna try and sell my clothes, and then we're gonna go to the comic book shop that he wants to go to. And then we're gonna get in and out and have our movie night tonight. I promised him we have this little movie night day tonight when I was like back in New York. Honestly, that's one of the things that I found the hardest about being on the other side of the country for school for a year and having like my younger brothers here because even Dylan, he's a middle child so I'm the oldest and he's graduating high school next month but it's like even though he's older and we're so much closer in age, it's like I feel like he's even changed so much since I've been gone and then Porter, my youngest brother, who's only 11, he has changed so much because he's in that stage where it's just like he's just growing up so much and that kind of made me sad sometimes like seeing him and seeing a photo and being like oh my god he looks so much older. I was a little emo that I wasn't there. I promised him this movie night a while ago. So we're gonna go do that. And then our movie that we watch together every single time is Nightmare Before Christmas. I kid you not, I've seen that movie so many times, but that's the one that he wants to watch tonight. So yeah. I know absolutely nothing about comics, but Porter picked out two that he liked, and then we made it to In-N-Out by Sunset, and we got to eat outside. It was so good, did not disappoint. We came back and watched our movie, and then I took a quick shower and just did my little nighttime routine. I do CeraVe moisturizer, and then I have this old acne spot treatment that I use at night from when I was younger, and then I've been using this Youth to the People dream mask every night for my birthday, and so far it's really good. I I love it. Lighting's really dark. Okay, the lighting is a little bit dark. <laughs> and the hair is a little bit crazy. So it's not the same day as you can tell. Um, also, I cleaned my room. Like I did a really big cleanup. I spent a whole day fixing everything because when I filmed this vlog, my room was a little bit messy and editing it. I was like, oh, did a big deep clean and now it looks better. Just wanted you to know. <laughs> so basically after that clip you just saw, I ended up editing for the rest of the night my last video, my 20th birthday vlog, but I don't know like if some of you saw, I posted, I ended up posting like a community posting, I never posted in the community tab. I did not vlog again because I ended up falling asleep editing and I was so bummed when I woke up because that was the first Sunday that I missed of not uploading for like over a month, but yeah, that vlog went up anyways, but I just didn't get around to like vlogging at all that night because I was so focused on editing editing that video and it did not happen which is okay because it happens sometimes it's up either way but I thought it would like this would be a good excuse to have a quick nighttime chat before I end the video obviously first year at NYU is done which is crazy and so exciting honestly I was I was struggling towards the end I'm still doing a couple of like little things to the end of my animation final and then I'll post it on YouTube like I told you guys I would so that should come up in the next Next couple weeks but I get so many comments about some of you who just got into NYU or you want to go to NYU about to start your first year first of all congratulations to those of you who did get in or to whatever school that you got into but because of that I was like I don't know I was thinking about doing a video that's kind of like what my first year at NYU was like and going over my film schedule for the fall semester and the spring semester dining halls and housing and all of that but I already did a NYU Q&A recently, so I don't know if that's still interesting. But if you think that's interesting and you have any like questions about my first year, then comment them below because I think I'll make that soon because hopefully that's helpful to somebody. Also, I wanna do more summer vlogs and summer videos too. I think those are fun. Like two videos I asked for book recommendations and everyone gave such good recommendations and I saw a lot of repeated like book titles and authors and stuff, so there's a lot of stuff that I really want to read this summer. Also, this Before the Coffee Gets Cold, that book I've been reading forever, I feel like, since spring break, just because I started it during school and like towards final season, so I really wasn't reading as much. But I promise you, I am finishing that book tonight. So in the next video, when you see me, I will be reading a different book because I want to kind of do like a little book club recap thing. If you're reading a book right now, then comment that below 
or just like in any video that comes up like comment the book you're reading or if you start a new book then comment when that video goes up I don't know I think it'd just be fun like at the end of summer to make a video and just kind of go over all the books that I've read over the summer and then like if you guys keep track of everything you read then that could be fun I also think seeing everyone else talk about the books they're reading motivates me more to read and it's just all good it goes full circle I can't tell if the lighting's absolutely horrible it's definitely giving like cozy bedroom sleepover night vibes um yeah but that was like the big thing that i really wanted to know about i don't know i feel like those two things are big to comment but if you like the emojis anyways i will always respond to the emoji comments with emojis as well although i do try and respond to like most of the comments i'm not famous at all but like when anyone takes time to comment on a video then i want to respond because i don't know it's like you have better things to do anyways hopefully we will have an nye recap video and i think going over the movies that i watched during school too or kind of the classes i think that'd be really fun but also i want to do more summer vlogs because if you didn't watch my birthday vlog i went to my favorite acai place here and I want to like vlog more with that and like being outside more and going to different beaches or like going to the shops around the beaches the beach towns thank you so much for watching that is so girl boss and this is gonna be our girl boss summer it's just not focusing on me our girl boss summer has begun have a good night and if you're not on summer break yet keep grinding keep grinding hopefully you're almost there okay bye I don't know why I do that either I'm just like Silly Goofy.